Hi Cajon players, I hope you are doing great. This is the first video of the year. I'm happy to be back here with this one that I think it will be helpful for you. To start the year, I've decided to start from the base. That for me is the posture, how to sit correctly on the Cajon. I'm going to show not only one, but three positions that I normally use when I'm playing and also some wrong positions that I think can be bad for your back and for your playing. For all these posture positions, I will suggest you to test it in front of a mirror. This will help you to see if you are doing it right. So let's start with the first position. This is the posture I suggest to everyone that is starting out. The first thing is how to properly sit on the cajon. This will be the same in all the positions I will show here in this video. When you sit on the cajon, I suggest that you leave a space in the front of the cajon seat. A space like the size of your hand. You need this space to play the slap tones on the top of the front plate. If you sit on the middle of the cajon, you end up hitting your legs. And we don't want that. It's very important to give room for your hands and arms to move freely. When you are seated on the cajon, you should keep your back straight and your arms relaxed. Your legs open and the feet flat on the ground. Always keep the back straight to avoid back pain. I see a lot of people playing with the back like this. This can be very bad for your back, be careful. I suggest you to do like this. Second position. For the second one, you keep the back straight and the feet flat on the ground like the first one. But now you are going to lean back the cajon a little bit, like this. This will help you reach the lower part of the instrument more easily, without bending over. You can notice how my back is straight when I lean back the cajon. And finally, the third position that I've seen many cajon players from Spain doing, uh, the masters of flamenco music. For this one, you position your legs in the sides of the cajon, like this. I have started using this position more often to play the sides of the cajon. When I have the legs in this position, it's easier to play patterns with the sides of the cajon, like this. But be careful with your back. Always keep the back straight to avoid back pain. And that's it. Those were the posture positions that worked for me. It's important to say that I'm always switching from one to the other, depending on the situation, like here in the studio, for example, or if I need to play a long gig that I probably switch and play all the three positions in the same gig. So I would like you to try these positions and tell me which one works better for you. Please comment below which one is your favorite of these three. And also if you have a different way to sit on the cajon. I'd love to know. Please comment below. And if you watch this and other videos on the channel and want to learn how to play the cajon, I'd like to invite you to join my online cajon school at cajonmaster.com. 
There is a lot of new content, lessons, courses, articles I would love to share with you. So go there now and join for free. Now do me a favor, hit the like button, share this video with someone that might be interested and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you didn't yet. Keep having fun playing the cajon. I hope this 2022 is gonna be a great year for you and for everybody that plays the cajon. Uh, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you very soon in the next video.